Ahoy mates, I'm Bobarb and I'm Tokyo TV and welcome back to Sam and Max Save the World and this is chapter 4 Ape Lincoln Must Die Sneaking the bug into that exorcism was an uncharacteristic stroke of genius. Demonic possession is the gift that keeps on giving. What? Oh, Commissioner. No, that was uh, Max's aunt. Yes, 14 packs a day. What's that? Yes. Yes? No. <laughs> yes? Sweet suffering Saint Sebastian on the sousaphone in a short story by... <laughs> We're on our way. Let me guess. Our no. Yes. Yes. No. Another monastery. No, <laughs> Far more bloodthirsty adversary this time. The President of the United States of America. Who? The man's gone nuts. He's enacting all kinds of crazy new laws. What else is new? Oh my. Dated group hugs before Ooh. and after all major sporting events. So? He's curtailing, <laughs> threatening the environment. Hey, that makes three of us. And he's about to introduce mandatory gun registration. Get the keys. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I hope the initial recording didn't already screw up the the synchronization. Dun 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 <laughs> Ape Lincoln must I have to point die. out that we could have avoided this gruesome accident if you just let me dry. And I have to point out that we could have avoided this gruesome accident if you hadn't jumped on my head shouting Jersey Devil, Jersey Devil and firing your gun out the window. I swear that woman was a dead ringer for him. Well, here oh, we are standing sure. in an open field west of the White House. Let's go bring the hammer down on that so-called commander in <laughs> The White House! Submarine. Wow! What can you feed a submarine anyway? Nothing. Weren't you listening? Hey! My missing boxing glove! It's always in the last place you look. Oh, shoot. Sure. At least the president has his priorities straight. <laughs> what? The White House. Pool. Most secure mm. waiting pool on Earth. Yep. Jimmy? Oh great! What it's on me. Oh, just saving the world. What are you doing here? I have to Jimmy, what are you doing here? Point. And I need a little R and R. Speaking of which, beat it. <laughs> Valley parking, two dollars. Uh-huh. Way to knock down that deficit. Bear. Post no bills. I'm surprised this sign survived the Clinton administration. Nice stool. It looks a little like a weird space creature, poised to devour the unwary mortal foolish enough to sit on it. <laughs> Suspect yourself. That's so Madonna. Hey, this phone only takes Susan B. Anthony dollars. It must be one of those stupid 555 phones. <laughs> yes, actually. Five 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 one nine eight four. <laughs> Did I ever mention how I've memorized pi to one thousand decimal places? It's three point one four one five nine two six five five eight nine seven nine. Do you have a piece of paper handy? You want to write down the nineteen eighty four. Remember the number. I want to write myself a reminder to smother you with a pillow in your sleep. Your name here. For naming rights to this building, please contact <laughs> Desperation Accounting. Oh boy, 
boy. Can we, Sam? Please? We'll see, little bunny. Dun 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 dun. Hmm. White paint, Christmas lights, and a small barbecue. Everything somebody yeah. needs to renovate, decorate, and then accidentally burn the place to the ground. Later, Max. Later. There is a small mailbox here. Uh, <laughs> ornamental mailboxes that doesn't actually open. Well, that's government efficiency for you. Later, later. Whee! Step aside, buddy. Freelance police. Just a moment, sir. Papa Bear, this is Super Bowl. Possible situation at the front door. Talking dog and <laughs> rabbit trying to gain access to the OO. Please advise over. Super Bowl? Yeah, that's a negative on the access permission, sir. I'll have to ask you and your little friend to step away from the one. Papa house. Bear. Talking Daddy, this is Loose Cannon. Request permission to pants this goon. Over. Before we try physical violence, Max, <laughs> let's try dazzling the man with our razor sharp wit and labyrinth and logical conundrums. Ah, emotional violence. Good plan. <laughs> Let us in, pal. We're freelance police. Here to save the president. I thought we were here to stop the president by any means. Whoa. I was going to wait to mention that part, Max. Uh -huh. Sir, you can't get inside. Orders. Seriously, Jack. Let yeah. us in. It's a national emergency. Max! can do, sir. Hmm. It's going to be tougher than I thought to trick this goon and get inside. I heard that. Either way. And it's going to be impossible. Hey, no fair. You're not supposed to listen to casual asides. It's in the job description, sir. Report all stage whispers, soliloquies, <laughs> and casual asides to the proper authorities. Curse them! They've thought of everything! Finest security force in the world, sir. Did you call yourself Super Bowl? Codename, sir. I'm a bouncer. Secret Service humor. And yeah. I'm Papa Bear. Section Chief. Runs the operation. Protects the president. Oh! Super Bowl! I get it! <laughs> I want to talk to your manager. No can do, sir. He's with the president. Don't you get bored guarding this door? It's a rewarding job, sir. Doing my part. Keeping the president safe. Hey, Super Bowl! I'd like you to smell these two handkerchiefs and tell me which one smells okay. more like chloroform. Not now, Max. <laughs> Is that all you do? Guard this door? That's my primary assignment, sir. I'm thinking of a number between one and one. What's your secondary assignment? Varies. Receptionist, maintenance, light grounds work, public relations. Public relations? I'm a people person, <laughs> sir. <laughs> doing odd jobs too? Cutback, sir. Employee reduction and consolidation oh, okay. for 2003. These sunglasses. Yeah! Are cheap. <laughs> Ball, what gauge syringe would be best for injecting you with a knockout serum? Just a hypothetical. You really have time to do everything else and guard this door? I love you people! <laughs> That's what I do. What else do you do besides guard <laughs> this door? Varies. I've had enough of this. Papa Bear, this is Super Bowl. Wow. Perps exiting zone 4 now. Seem disgruntled. Stay on the lookout. Over. Now can we push him down and beat him with sewage filled okay. garbage bags until he <laughs> runs crying into the reflecting pool? Tempting, Max. But these Secret Service guys hold a grudge. Where are we going, Sam? Back to the... <laughs> I'll drive! Not while I'm alive. Exactly! <laughs> Back to the office! <laughs> Bye, Super Bowl! Whee! These damn loading screens! I hope they don't get the delay! Mm. What? Love is for everyone! Dating service! Do you guys okay. want to submit an application for my dating service? That depends. How extensive are your background checks? Some other time, Max. <laughs> hey, Sybil. What's new in the world of frequent random oh, clarity really? assessment? Hi, fellas. Wow. I'm really excited. I found the perfect job for me. You don't say. <laughs> That's right. I, Sybil Pandemic, am now a professional matchmaker. <laughs> I thought I smelled phosphorus. I thought I smelled Hi, that coming down the turnpike, burning oil and dragging its muffler. It's a dating <laughs> service, Max. I figured that if a smart, successful yeah. career woman like me could be having so much trouble finding a date, <laughs> there must be plenty of other people who could use help. 
You're having trouble finding your soulmate? You don't know the half of it. It seems like all the guys I meet are total losers. No offense. None taken. Hey! Or else they're borderline psychopaths. No offense. None taken! It's the borderline cases you have to watch out for. Uh. What kind of man are you looking for? Older men. Guys with a little history to them are such a turn on. <laughs> oh, and tall men. <laughs> and he should be experienced. All right, enough already. Yes, I will go out with you, Sybil. I thought she was talking about me. What's next <laughs> on the near horizon? Next? This is gonna this be is useful later. Be a better job than helping people find their perfect okay. match. Okay. Volcano guy. Good okay. Point. I'll stick to the dating business though. <laughs> How many couples have you managed to escort to romantic bliss? So far, none. None is the loneliest number. But I've got a feeling things will. No, this is up. it, really. This is it. Every time is it. Messy breakups and a lot of people looking for romance on the rebound. So we have something to look forward to. How's business? Slow right now, Ugh. but those applications are going to start coming <laughs> in at any moment. Could you find dates for Max and me? Seriously? I mean, sure. Why not? Oh wow. Stranger well. things have happened. I guess they must have somewhere. I'm choosing not to be offended by that. What do we need to do? It's easy. Just submit an application. Uh -huh. <laughs> What kind of stuff is on this application? <laughs> she take a, a kind of uh, last for? job seriously, Hooks apparently. When you're done, I'll put the application into my computer, <laughs> which analyzes your personality matrix at 15 essential compatibility points. I don't have a personality matrix so much as a personality vector. Once we've found a match, you call your date and agree uh -huh. on a time and place. <laughs> Tell me your good points and what you're looking for in a date. Uh huh. Your computer. She should love animals. Such as the elusive praying mantis, whose deadly but enthralling <laughs> mating rituals she mimics. You really know how to ruin the mood, Max. Oh, and cybernetic implants, like an elbow that can connect to the internet. Um. I'm very spiritual. A disciple of the ancient ones, enacting dark magic rituals to bring forth their reign again upon this earth. Rise, Shigarat! Rise, Abyak Solem! Uh huh, uh huh. Just writing everything. Um. Always running from the authorities. I can appreciate a person's energy. <laughs> I even have my own sonogram machine. She should have an air of Shigurat. Making frequent passing mention to her time on the chain gang, but when pressed, revealing nothing. Nah. <laughs> she should love the outdoors. We frequently lock ourselves out of the office. <laughs> she should be tall. At least 12 feet, or 4 meters if she's Canadian. You crack me up, little buddy. That's all I can think of. Oh, that's <laughs> She's a little concerned. Now, applications into the computer. And <laughs> there it is. Max, it says your perfect match is... Sorry, <laughs> oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Well, that's interesting. It says your perfect match is Sam. <laughs> that's true, plenty. Unexpected. And Sam, your ideal soulmate is... Wait for it, Max. Well, there goes another blow to the <laughs> fair and just universe. Hey, Sam, what do you say we never ever speak of this again? Way ahead of you, little buddy. <laughs> See you around, Sybil. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, you're right, guys. I'm f 15 minutes in the episode and we didn't see Bosco. Oh, you really want to see Bosco, aren't you?
<laughs> Whoa, look, Max. Oh. It's our favorite cultist. That guy was. Hi, uh. I'm Hugh Bliss. I want to buy something. Take my credit card. Put me on your mailing list. Anyone you want me to recruit? Dun, dun. To oh my god. <laughs> to kick in, Max. Who has that kind of time? Uh. What's a big celebrity like you doing on our street, you bliss? <laughs> Why, I'm spreading the Hey, I'm you bliss! Yeah! <laughs> it's a bliss! Uh -huh. ...in holistic personal and interpersonal well-being. <laughs> now translated into 15,000 different languages, including Esperanto. <laughs> Hooray! Hooray! Are the books selling well? Selling? Please, not you can't sell the wonder of a daydream or the laughter of a child. He's right. I've tried. <laughs> hey! Book about again? Emetics, the handbook for multicolored happiness. It's about everything and nothing at all. Well, uh, you can. What's this you can. nonsense really about? Oh, <laughs> this is. The total reawakening of mind, body, and spirit in a rainbow. Oh no. Everything. Ah. Everything. Really and nothing at all. How do we do that? Okay. Simply focus on the orange at the core of your spirit. <laughs> okay. No, wait. Okay, now. Shift your consciousness to the ultraviolet. Doing that? In a rainbow. The go of your imagination. And then let it slide down the rainbow of your hopes and dreams. Wow, I can't believe it was. The orange go. <laughs> you stay in business. With the magic of volume and free delivery. You can have yeah. all the colors delivered to your home for no green. I don't get it. Nah! <laughs> Show us a magic trick, you bliss. Magic is easy when the colors <laughs> of your soul are Yeah, yeah, less chatter, it. more magic. Okay! Ha 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 ha! I disappear! Ha 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 ha! Now watch me as I vanish. Except you won't be able to watch me because I'll be gone! <laughs> hey, free <laughs> Really? President <laughs> you're as Secretary of Defense. That is pretty crazy. Well, at least it was an action figure. No. Oh, I can dig it. A non-mafia owned casino destroyed by mysterious explosion. Whoa. Mysterious? I gave my name to reporters and even posed for pictures. Sometimes blowing something up is its own reward, you know? <laughs> nah. Wait, wait, wait. Like what was the title? Trading Monkey? Monkey Island yeah. Reference. Annoy your grandparents. Oh. <laughs> what shake it? Oh, okay. Ah, uh, greetings, comrades, dog and rabbit. I'm having trouble placing the accent. Are you ready for Bosco, guys? Are you ready for Bosco? Hmm, I get more of a vague Baltic vibe. Something in a light check pattern. <laughs> Let's see Bosco. Makes a million makes the funny joke. I am Vladimir Ilyevich Boskovorsky, Russian proprietor of work <laughs> warehouse of inconvenience. No? He's Russian. Yes. But now I make new start in America, which I love. Russia, Sam. So aiming sophisticated targeting equipment at me. Something in here smells like fermented hate. It's like sweaty jock straps soaked <laughs> in boiled cabbage with a dash of salt. Keep it down, guys. You're scaring off all the customers. What other customers? Max and I are always the only ones in here. Is good thing. <laughs> Merchandise is always available. Coming in here is like visiting <laughs> old friends. Some of these cereal boxes are from the McKinley administration. I carved our initials in one of the weenies, so we'll be best friends forever, Sam. When's the well, uh, customers? The weenie rotation. Ah, uh, okay. Needs no cleaning. Adds vintage flavor to tasty friends.
What's with the Soviet bluff, <laughs> Roscoe? He's perfectly natural, comrade. <laughs> I work with your American government in spirit of Glasnost. They know. They know. Who knows what? The feds, man. Uncle <laughs> Sam. The government's watching us all the time. So that's why I always feel an yeah. overwhelming presence just out of my field. I love Winnie's, by the way. Watching my every move. That's me, Max. <laughs> Why is the government spying on you, Bosco? I don't know. Maybe okay. because I know too much. Um, just humor the poor guy, Max. But I make new start in America, which uh -huh. I love. So there's no need to target me. Well, I suppose you've got some ridiculous oh, uh, complex whirly gig to defend yourself against the feds. The people, comrade. <laughs> Workers will overthrow fascist regime. What about us loafers? All are welcome. Come to well, the do you know? will unite to bring <laughs> downfall of corrupt administration. We will number in tens of millions. That's a lot of Bolsheviks. No, he's all true. Plus, satellite <laughs> missile defense system. Missile defense system? No, oh, come on. Bit overkill? Yes, so communist stereotype. Strong, like bear against the pack. I'm working on modifying BTAS part D. Your anti-delivery system? That's right. It was already programmed <laughs> to keep people from delivering goods to the store, so I just went into the database and changed beef jerky to intercontinental ballistic missiles. Uh -huh. So now anyone can just deliver a blimp load of beef jerky to your store without fear of reprisal? It's small price to pay for freedom. We want to buy something. Da is evil but necessary private enterprise. Do you have any uh -huh. photos in the likeness of Catholic saints? Yet. Do you have any souvenir snow globes from the Mystery Vortex? Yet. Do you have any Lobster Fox brand series? <laughs> Yet. Do you have any Tagalog rhyming dictionaries abridged? Yet. Do you have any Wiener uh -huh. Da. We yeah. just get shipment of those in this week. Let me look. Oh, <laughs> Wait. Did you say Wiener Cozy? I thought you said Navajo. <laughs> no, we're all out of Wiener Cozy. Do you have any Navajo blankets? Yet. 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 Do you have any potatoes Yet. in the Yet. Yet. What do you got? He's a glorious invention, comrade. He's useful for oh. how you say questioning. Questioning. He's true, sir. What? It makes easy, even the most difficult, how you say interrogation. Interrogation. <laughs> True serum? Is this another one of your half-baked overpriced gimmicks or does it actually work? Both will make anyone get rid of inhibitions and telling, uh, how you say, uh, complete and honest truth. Your accent sucks. <laughs> hey, it's already working. Truth serum. Oh, Max. We'd like that truth serum, comrade Boscovich. It's yes. Good. Price is 867.509 rubles. How much is that in real money? 100 million dollars. I think your huh. rate of exchange is a little off, Boscovorsky. <laughs> All of Berlin Wall brings great strength to our economy. How much for the truth serum? Maybe it's 10 be a billion. Isn't that a little pricey for truth serum? It's bargain. It really does work, and I haven't even tried it yet. Sam, this morning in I American dollars, results are guaranteed. I uh, need to clean out my ears. One hundred million. Refreshingly liberating. <laughs> Besides, I need the money to complete my satellite defense system. I needed to that clean was out in '89. So okay, I've heard enough. <laughs> Nothing for us right now. <laughs> See you later, Bosco. He's oh, Bosco, comrade. <laughs> loyal work trust me, Bosco, trust me. Who is no threat to glorious American Max. government whatsoever? Uh huh. Max. <laughs> Sludgies. This week's flavors: caviar and borscht. Borscht, the red menace. It's Boscovich. Boskovorski, of course. Let's see the sludgy taste this month.
Okay, um... Oh yes, the office! Loading screen. We're in the office. Oh, the TV, the TV, of course. Fellow Americans, we must remember to live life to that end. I have wow. He's like a kind of... What? Oh, Max. It's our favorite shifty card cheat, Leonard Steak Charmer. How you doing, Leonard? Good, good. What's in the closet this time? Yeah, cute from far away. Hi, Leonard. Scary when you look at him through a microscope. Our thugs and hoodlums final cabinet is almost full. I can see you. Help it if I come from a large family. Wait. And farm. Take up a surprising amount of space. <laughs> Hello, constituents. This is your present. When I took office three years ago, I made a small promise to help you, the American people. Now, thanks to your collective short-term <laughs> memory, I can say that I've delivered on that promise. Let's see. Oh, the answering machine, of course. In the upcoming election, it's important to ask yourself, do you feel safer than you did three years ago? Or would you rather return to the days when crazy? Mr. Pizza, two medium pineapple and asbestos pies, please. Oh yeah? Well, same to you, jerk. Um... What'd he say? Thank you, and have a nice day. Who are you calling, Sam? Okay. The White House. White House, Agent Super Bowl speaking. Uh... Mizza Pizza! <laughs> Have you checked the baby? Yes, sir, sleeping soundly. Oh, good job. Uh, what kind of pizza is that? Calling Sam. Uh, the White House. White House. Agent Super Bowl speaking. The White House. We've got two very special agents coming to the White House today. One is tall, well dressed, and devilishly handsome, and the other is Max. Oh, uh, 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 over. Really? <laughs> Do that form, sign <laughs> the White House. Who are you calling, Sam? The White House. White House, Agent Super Bowl speaking. Hello. <laughs> Our phone bill is sure gonna be expensive. Definitely she and some. I've been paying them out of your retirement fund. Hello. Is anyone there? Uh, yes. Where are we going, Sam? We're off to nope. the White House. Oh boy! Give us the right time and we're on the. Hello. Is anyone there? Dun 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 dun.